Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, now we have our first official proof of version 25H2 for Windows 11 that is coming this fall. The uh, dev version, if you're Windows Insider and you're on the dev uh, ring, the uh, new update that you've received will show you that if you type Winver for the Windows version, that dev version, instead of having 24H2 like we have right now, it's going to display 25H2. It's the first time they make the change. Usually when that change happens in a Windows Insider build, it means that we're not that far off from that new version coming eventually. So uh, it is official that we have 25H2 coming. We knew about it. Of course, we talked about it. We even talked about some of the features. But now with this announcement, we know that uh, Microsoft made it more of an official release. The uh, 25H2, from what we know, should work on unsupported hardware with the usual tricks we have right now. A lot of people are wondering, do you get the security updates on unsupported? Just like you do on unsupported 23H2, 24H2 you get updates or you get the security updates. Uh, it's not the problem is not security updates that you don't get. The problem is eventually they could say that, you know, 26H2, for example, will not be uh, working on unsupported, but I don't think they will ever change that. I think that uh, having some unsupported Windows 11 machines is maybe something Microsoft actually kind of, you know, want because it makes the numbers higher when they have the market share numbers. So uh, anyways, 25H2 is coming and it's official now and uh, it will be released. There's no official date. Of course, it's too early, but they will be released uh, this fall at some point with some of the new features coming to this version. A lot of new features for the Copilot plus AI PCs. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.